We begin right away with breaking news in the Texas Panhandle where crews are battling a massive fire that's on track to become the largest in state history. The Smokehouse Creek fire has scorched more than 850,000 acres and it's only 3% contained right now. To put that in perspective, the burned areas are equal to all of Dallas County and half of Tarrant County combined. Let's go to a live picture right now in Amarillo. You can see some smoke there, but, but this is just one perspective of the blaze. Some of the stories we've heard from people who have have escaped the fire have been really terrifying. Yeah, the fire is threatening homes, farms, businesses. Thousands of people are under evacuation orders right now, and many of them are trying to navigate through that hazy fire smoke to get away. Frantic video shows cattle galloping as fast as they could yesterday against a mountain of smoke in the background there and fire, and the people recording this video actually running with them. We can't hold it. We got fire on both sides of us. We can't even see. Let's pull out. We got too many spots. Yeah, you can hear what it's like right now for the crews trying to contain this fire. Firefighters are being called in from across the street, the state to lend a hand. And just hours ago, the Fort Worth Fire Department posted this video showing a terrifying sight. Thick smoke covering the horizon and coating what's left of it in that orange haze. Dallas, Fort Worth, McKinney and Flower Mound have all mm. sent crews to help and we're going to hear a lot more from them coming up tonight at six. But first, Chief Meteorologist Pete Delkis is here for more context on this fire. We're told this is just one of what, four fires? Four. I mean, it, it is tragic what is happening up there right now. I mean, there's dozens and dozens of families and homes that have been just completely lost and and I mean, it, not even close to being contained. I mean, and it's going to continue. I want to show you where we're talking about right now. There's the uh, context. So we're looking right around uh, interstate state 40 and north from Amarillo north and east. You can see the fires that are burning there. Let's talk about the first one. This is Grapevine Creek fire, 60% uh, contained, but the fire size right now is 30,000 acres on this fire to the west of there. The Magenta fire, it's only 40% contained right now. It's 2000 acres to the northeast of there. The Windy Deuce fire. Here's Dumas just on the east side of a 287, 25% contained. It's 90,000 acres. And then we head just to the to the east of there. <clears throat> here's Sanford, Borger, here's Stinnett, <clears throat> 687, Reamer Fire, 10% contained, 2,000 acres. And then the big one right now, the Smokehouse uh, Creek Fire, that's only 3% contained. It's 850,000 acres right now, and it is unfortunately growing. That's the way things look with the, the fires that we're looking at. These are the winds. The winds have been, people have asked me throughout the day today, are we seeing uh, smoke here in uh, North Texas? We have these clouds, but we're not seeing any smoke. This is the direction that the smoke is blowing right now. So there's the forecast at seven tonight. And then the winds will switch and they'll turn out of the south and they'll be blowing the smoke more to the north up into Oklahoma and then up into Kansas as well. That's where it will stay uh, through the next, about the next 48 hours.